my channel guys. Today we're gonna do a grocery haul healthy style. I know when you're first starting your weight loss journey or you're trying to eat a healthier lifestyle, you're always about, okay, so exactly when I go to the gym, what do I get? You have no idea, you know, when I started, I had the same thing. I didn't know what was good because a lot of things are labeled healthy, but they're really not when you look at the nutrition facts in the back. I'll show you guys what my day-to-day -day grocery uh, shopping is like, so please leave a comment down below if you have questions regarding anything, and I'll go ahead and list some of the macros just so you guys have an idea. I was at Walmart, and you guys will see that in the video. So let's get into this video. Look at the macros on this pita bread. It's amazing. Literally, it's about four grams of carb for half of it. And if you eat the whole thing, which is okay to do so, it's about eight grams of carb, which is like nothing. So you can easily fit that in your macros if you follow that type of diet. Or you could also just eat that in general if you're following your healthier life. A lot of people are like, bread, that's bad. Carbs, stay away. Not really. When you look at a wheat bread, the macros on those are actually really amazing, especially if you get the right one. So majority of the time, one slice is about 10 grams of carb and it barely has any sugar, about one gram or two grams of sugar. So what I'm trying to say is carbs is not a bad thing. Carbs, do not stay away from carbs. Eat carbs, you need to fuel your body, but make sure to get the good carbs. You know, so that's what I'm trying to get to. But bread is okay to have on a healthier lifestyle. As long as you don't eat too much of anything, you're okay. As you balance it out, that's all that matters at the end of the day.
saving grace. Like, I have such a sweet tooth. This is such a good way for me to suppress that appetite and it tastes amazing. These Atkin bars taste pretty great. The macros on this are amazing. The little square pieces one, um, the caramel, has about 9 grams of fat, 2 grams of carbs. Two guys, the net carb is two, like it's amazing. And only one gram of protein. The only reason why I don't care too much about the protein is especially when I'm at the end of my day and I don't have much macros to mess with and I'm so low on my macros, these square um, chocolate bars are such a good way to like help with that because I could just pop two, three in and it would not be worth anything. <laughs> grocery haul I spent only 120 this lasted me about two weeks and I would have to spend another 30 to 50 dollars to you know buy extra stuff spending only 120 with that grocery haul I did that does not sound so bad eating healthy you can still have fun with it I play with my foods all the time but within my macros a lot of the foods I play with are really ca um, macro friendly meaning it's really healthy eating unhealthy has so much health risk so if you can avoid it because this is what you're doing to yourself please avoid it do it for yourself don't do it for anybody else start eating healthy to be healthier you feel amazing you feel better so slowly start to adapt healthier habits. I hope you guys are able to get some sort of an idea of a healthy grocery haul. Start your healthier lifestyle by going to the grocery store, getting healthy foods, and going from there. You know, one step at a time. Losing weight or developing a healthier lifestyle does not happen overnight. It's a process, it's a journey. So take your time with it, enjoy the process, enjoy your journey. I really hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you guys have any questions, please leave it in the comments down below. I hope you, <clears throat> I'll see you guys in my next one.